Nah. Hello, I'm Ryan. And this is a video with Jay's doing and he's gonna tell you guys at home how to download mods and stuff. Enjoy! Hey guys, I'm Jason McDean. This is going to be a short video about how to make uh, make your mods work and shit. Okay, um, the ones there are the audio mods and mod helpers, mod loader, GUI, API, custom mob spawner, and there's the mod at the right, uh, Doctor's Ark, more creatures. Okay, what you're going to want to do is go into percentage app, data percentage, go into your dot Minecraft, uh, then your bin, then there's open Minecraft.jar with your WinRAR or 7-zip, what, oh, 7 something, I don't know what the hell it's called. Um, but if you've already got mods installed, then you might want to go to Force Update uh, because that might help you with this. But delete meta, uh, meta inf because that is a anti-mod kind of file. Uh, the mods I'm going to help you guys install is Timber, Unofficial Tale of Kingdoms, well the Tale of Kingdoms mod, whatever. Uh, more creeps and weirdos, elemental creepers, and Doctor Zark's more creatures mod. I'm going to be using these mods to make a short series of videos where I get pissed off by crap. Okay, uh, I'm going to just put in the audio mod thing there. Uh, just copy and paste that in. First, probably going to want to do that because make sure that you copy it down into the class files. Because if you don't, then if you copy it into the ones there. It will probably put you into kind of uh, might put them into a different folder. Okay, now we've got audio mod in. I'm going to put in mod loader. Um, some of these files are quite long, like the GUI API and stuff. Um, if you can install the mod creatures mod, you can probably install most other mods because that one's normally the hardest. Okay, now to GUI API with this one will probably take a while. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be using the mods there that are on the sides for my video, uh, for some more videos and stuff. Um, Ryan was in the intro of this video, it was pretty fucked up. I'm just going to talk about that. He's fucked up. Okay, done. I'm just going to minimize them and then probably bring them back up soon or something. I'm just going to go into percentage app data right now. I may just keep that there. Uh, go back down to dot Minecraft. Right now, uh, I'm just going to minimize that. Um, let's see if this is done yet. It's nearly done. I can see that in the bottom. Okay, uh, just okay. And then this one may take a bit as well. Not too long, because now we can just close that and go to custom mob spawner, which I don't put in yet. Uh, just move them two out of the way that I've just moved. Uh, then you're going to wait for that to do uh, to that to finish. And now the first thing I'm going to do is install the Doctor's Ark small creatures. Uh, don't open that, I did not mean that. Um, but first you need to go put the Doctor's Arcs into your dot .minecraft folder and extract here. And that will put in a new folder called mods and that should have the mod creatures in it as well. And it's also put some stuff into the resources folder. Uh, like the uh, mods stuff there. Okay, more creatures is there, so what you're going to want to do is put custom mob spawner in there. And this is compatible with 1.4 and 1.2.5, uh, I think. I'm not really sure about that, so don't quote me on that. Uh, uh, now I'm probably going to just install the timber mods and stuff that's here, uh, but in fact, no, I'm not. Okay, first, the mod loader MP and Minecraft Forge is both for the more, more creeps and weirdos mod. Uh, which I'm going to just bring up. Um, this, that's some of the ones we're going to install. Um, so yeah, and think the mole creature. No, the not that one. We've done with the mole creatures one. That's all you need to do for the mole creatures one. If that's all you want to see, then you're free to watch the rest of the video or wherever. Okay. Uh, now I am just going to copy all this in might take a second because this one is quite a big file as well oh well no it's already done okay um, just gonna close that and go to timber mod now and just start installing the actual mods um, this one only has two things make sure to not copy in that text document because it might screw your stuff up and you may need to restart uh, an official tale of kingdoms mod that's just tale of kingdoms mod updated by someone else really uh, that's pretty much why it's unofficial because it's not that guy who made it. Um, so yeah.
just wait uh, for this to I'll just copy and paste all this in or highlight or whatever this one doesn't take too long which is quite good for quite a good mod it's quite a fun mod as well and stuff but this next one the more creeping weirdos will take a while uh, so while that's happening I'm just gonna go and okay it needs to load this file here this is only one file you just put in the actual folder and it will put everything in all the sounds and everything sounds are pretty funny some of them uh, some of them are pretty screwed up as well uh, just stuff like that okay I put in the mod loader MP and stuff that's just the kind of stuff I'm just gonna put that over there next to culture too uh, that stuff that I put in there is for the more curriculum weirdos as I've already said uh, this more curriculum weirdos is nearly already done and then it will be the elemental creepers um, which you get loads of different creepers it's pretty fun mod it's a pretty awesome mod as well with what you can do with it okay that's that done just uh, press that okay this one will take a second as well so I'm just going to put this one up and copy all of them or whatever highlight uh, wait for that to finish and then that should update on the left and then the right I will just copy and paste into the A, A class and whatever to put them down there uh, okay Okay, now you're going to test the mod and make sure it's worked. Because um, if you don't do that, you might screw, uh, it might have screwed up your Minecraft and stuff, and you might not be able to get on it. The way to make sure that this does work is that when you log in, uh, it works. And see that black screen there? If that stays there for too long, you know you've screwed it up, and you you need to force update. Um, another way to know if it's kind of screwed up if it, is if it doesn't load your world properly or anything you need to start again I'm just going to call this mods test uh, not mods test ok I'm just going to check if this has worked uh, Minecraft screws up a bit here because of all the mods and I've re-downloaded Minecraft for this and stuff to screw up the mods so just let that load it's a bit laggy because I've not got any extras running uh, the thing so it doesn't stop lagging or whatever Okay, well the Tail of Kingdoms mod, as you can see, works, and you can just press exit there on that whenever, I think, just after about 10 seconds or something, I normally do it. And then you can turn around, and sorry for the lag, guys, uh, I'm not running anything else. So, that's, you can tell the Tail of Kingdoms mod works, and that means that most of them will probably work. Uh, they all worked for me in this. And you'll see a mist down there, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong, I don't really know what the hell animals are or anything, I just put them into fuck the game and stuff because it's pretty fun to screw up games I do it quite a lot and stuff um, but thanks for watching uh, rate and subscribe for more of this or some of my other videos uh, go check them out uh, as you can see the mods have worked and stuff and I'm just going to spawn in Expa Excalibur the sword thing that's not very good and stuff, you know, because it's awesome even though it's not Thank you for watching, rate and subscribe, um, comment, whatever, goodbye.